Today we will uh, use the uh, content management system Zoops, X O O P S, to uh, try to uh, uh, get information about it and uh, set for you. Uh, so first, what you need to do is hopefully panel. It's a cPanel host because it makes it a lot easier to install all, uh, um, a software or a scripts such as uh, Zoops. And hopefully, it, uh, it only have C comes with um, Pro. Easy to solve the script right of the Zoops content management. So what you do is you log into your control panel, your C panel, go into uh, uh, Fantastico, and then on the left you should be able to, to find something called Zoops. And then you simply click on that and follow the instructions on how to. Once you you should have your a uh, username and password so, wait, which I've already and then username. And then it says thank you for logging in. Left hand side, what you do is that there's an administration menu and you can go in there to uh, make all sorts of changes to your uh, um, site. So then it says, this is your first time to enter the administration se uh, section. Press the button below to proceed. So I press submit then. And then it gives us the system administration. So if we click the icon on the left, there's a lot of uh, um, uh, options that we can have. So right now, if we go to our home page, we actually don't really uh, see anything. Um, um, not really. Zoops has a lot of also. You can um, go to its section. What you do is this folder with files on how to upload and download files with an FTP client. So if you want, you can take a look at that on how to use something like that. So once you upload it, you, you should have a new module somewhere down here. And then it'll ask you if you want to, uh, it'll, it'll give you uh, an option to install it. And then you click it, and then it, after it installs, the icon comes up here. And then you have your module. And then when you go to the home page, for example, various 345 is uh, all, it'll be a content. So if we go to the uh, Zoops web, there's also information column on modules. I find that it's, uh, sometimes people have one to on this uh, system and admin uh, user info setting. All of these are very useful. So this is just a very basic introduction to Zoops and uh, setting it up. Um, we'll probably uh, delve into more details on using Zoops uh, later on. Thank you. And you can always log out, of course. And when you've logged out, you can um, log back in again, or you can register a new user. Thanks for watching.